Coach Jalen, thank you so much for joining us. Coach, I want to start here before we dive into some film. Uh, you, you're a little bit hands-on with the defense right. this year. You're moving back into kind of your roots. That has to be exciting each and every day. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Uh, you know, I've been a defense coordinator a lot of my career. And uh, just to be back in there with, you know, hands on with the defense, with the, with the secondary, uh, it's been good for all of us. Jalen, being a DB, you see this guy all the time now. Is it a hate-love relationship? I'm just kidding. It's got to be fun, though, having the head guy in there and giving you guys those extra details. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Uh, just having him in the meetings and having him uh, on field at practice through Indy, things like that, just giving us uh, extra little tidbits. Uh, He's worked with a lot of great DBs, and he pretty much uh, prepares us with different tools that he's given these DBs that are playing at the next level. So just being able to uh, be coached by him a lot more helps a lot now. I know that's cool. So you have all these meetings. Now you get an extra one because you're doing this with us. Coach, <laughs> let, take us into training camp a little bit. This is a unique thing that yeah. we haven't done anywhere else. Appreciate you. Uh, let's dive into some practice because we know each and every rep is evaluated, graded, right. and the competition, man, matters. Yeah, absolutely. We had practice this morning. Uh, then I go in there and meet with the coaching staff, watch the film, uh, and then the guys go, Jalen's got a lift, and then he comes back and he meets with the secondary coaches. And uh, so, you know, this is just a couple of plays from uh, preseason practice. You know, this is some stuff that we're doing, um, you know, showing some different things. A quarter's look, we have a max. Uh, quarters presentation and uh, Jalen right here is going to poach to the front side and uh, max protection, deep layered shot and uh, you know Jalen does a nice job reading his backside quarters and then easing up to the front side, taking a little pressure off of DA over here, um, but max protection shot and then Jalen gets a really good read and nice little finishing tool right there by Jalen King, but I'll take this back so Jalen can walk us through uh, what he's seeing right here. So initially, I see that we're in a 12 personnel. Uh, that's usually a max pro set. So I knew once the boot was going away from the tight end, because if you're going to be in 12, most likely you're going to run the ball towards the tight end. So once I see that goes away, I figure they're going to try to take a deep shot. So since I saw nothing working towards me, I tried to look and help my uh, other DBs. And once I saw the deep crosser, I decided to pick it up so DA can fall off and work on the other one, come back across. And what's so impressive is you, you see the hips flip. I mean, you're screaming to the middle of the field and, and you see a post, you know, coming over the top. Are you reading quarterback here first? You see that guy coming. What kind of made you make this decision right when you get to the hat? Uh, I'm reading quarterback initially, but then throughout my peripheral vision, I saw Malachi running across the field, so I flipped my hips to try and play the ball. As you see Jeff start working back towards uh, the right on the screen. And right there, the first man up wins. Jalen was the first man up. He was able to win the rep. So right here, the second shot, uh, more of a four down look, four down presentation, changing up the structure on the fourth, uh, front side, playing a little quarter, quarter half with the abs being to the field. A lot of stress right here. We're putting on the nickel. They get a run pass read for Jalen playing the quarter side. And then once he gets that, you see Jalen doing a great job going to help out on the quarters uh, to make another really nice finish on the, on the play. And I'll let Jalen take it through right here. Get back to the other view. Yeah, sure. I like that coaching. Coaching them up. Come on, <laughs> baby. Coaching them up. So um, I take a little slam step pretty much to get a run pass read. Once I see that my tight end uh, rocks back, I kind of like zone my quarter. Uh, probably try not to waste myself on the down. So I just look for help. Uh, and then I was able to be at the right place, right time to help uh, Caleb uh, at nickel. One of the biggest things that Jalen provides us on the back end is obviously getting everybody lined up, making all the calls from the back side to the front side, great communication throughout, and just the trust level right there uh, to be able to come across and make that finishing play and a little celebration, help your teammate up for the whole sides of the ball. Um, so this is another shot where showing a three down presentation, but we're gonna trigger Caleb to add that fourth rusher and then now getting uh, Spider down here, number zero, to trigger very fast to set an edge and then DA coming from the strong safety position, Jalen coming the pursuit uh, at a very high level. We've got two perimeter blockers being taken up and now the pursuit, once we've set the edge, build a wall and now just sending it back to everybody. You see Jalen uh, coming from the deep middle third, running to get the thud and then Caleb Edwards, who we trigger on the blitz right here. So he's blitzing, now the ball's released, slam that foot in the ground and get back into pursuit at a very high level. This is a six foot seven receiver, number zero, coming out here after a six foot four corner. Uh, really good players, 
competing every single day, uh, making each other better, being physical, uh, but also being smart as we go. We're out there in shells and uh, shorts just flying around, making each other better. Guys being dudes, executing at a high level. Yep. The effort is there. Coach, excited for Saturdays. We're coming soon. Absolutely. Okay. Appreciate you guys.